Sumi Central City Hospital. It is a modern medical facility where more than 200,000 Ukrainians are treated annually. Ms. Valentina is its director. A year and a half ago, she was most afraid of coming to work and not seeing anyone. I every time I go to work, I thought only one thing, and I was afraid of one thing, that I come and find out that people went. At the beginning of the open Russian invasion, Sumy was surrounded. This is a border region. There were street fights in the city, food was running out, and pharmacies were closed. In the first few days, about 80,000 people left Sumy. But not Miss Valentina. Almost all the staff stayed with her. On the most difficult days, the ward spent the night at work. The hospital quickly filled up with the wounded and sick people. We managed to stock up on medicines and food, but no electricity. There were problems with that. Коли ми були оточені, були ж такі дні, коли в нас не було зовсім світла, і генератор наш, який ми раніше колись давно отримали, безумовно, він нам послужив, але питання було з забезпеченням пальним, яке не довозилось в той час в місто. Electricity ensures the operation of resuscitation and diagnostic equipment, water supply, heating and cooking for hundreds of patients. If it goes out and the generators have nothing to work on, human lives are at risk. Лікарні потребують постійного живлення, люди не мають можливості чекати, коли там увімкнеться генератор чи будь-які інші речі, чи коли поремонтується підстанція. After what we have been through, the issue of stability and control over the situation is especially important for doctors. They remain a border town. Special attention is paid to the stability and reliability of energy supply. That's why the solar station was built. For this reason, the solar station was installed on the roof. The NGO Echo Club helped with it. The money was raised by people in several European countries. Everyone gave as much as they could. I'm so happy that I was able to help um, raise funds for um, the installation of solar power at Sumi Hospital because now there's one hospital that will not stop working if there's a power cut. My grandfather was Ukrainian, so this is a, a cause that's quite close to me. When I heard about the, the work they're doing to put solar panels in hospitals, it seemed like a really great cause because that's critical infrastructure and that builds some sort of resilience against the sort of attacks that are happening there. So I was really glad to help. When I saw how it works, it changes reality. І саме такі пілотні проекти, коли ти можеш прийти, пощупати, зрозуміти, як воно працює, подивитися ці кабеля, зрозуміти, що це не космос. От воно працює, ось попадає, ось там є електрика. Воно реально тоді працює на людей для того, щоб вони приймали подібні рішення. The city authorities of Suma realized long ago that renewable energy sources are the future. A few years ago, they installed solar panels on the alarm systems. Even without electricity, People could hear about the danger. Now citizens are returning to the city. Businesses and enterprises are relocating. Це також людей спонукає бути впевненим в тому, що те, що відбувається в місті, це не випадково, а це прогнозовано. Ті люди, які залишилися, це більшості літні люди. Вони не можуть тут жити, якщо не живе місто. Якщо немає послуг, якщо не за немає відповідного забезпечення, якщо тут поруч з ними не живуть їхні діти. Solar panels on the roof of Suma Central Hospital are already producing their first energy. Almost half a million hryvnias at the 2023 tariff, which will be saved with solar energy in just one year, will be used to develop the medical facility. It needs more power as the number of equipment is growing. Ти в будь-який час зможеш надати людям допомогу і не будеш боятися, що в тебе цієї можливості не буде. Це безумовно класно. After a severe injury, Alexei has to undergo rehabilitation in a hospital. An additional source of energy on the roof allows him to be confident not only for himself, but also for his family. Чим лучше у тебе прикритил, тим ти там спокійний. Тобто ти розумієш, що, в принципі, що б там не случилось, 
тут как бы там можно это все как-то нормализовать, восстановить. Во всем мире это стоит, во всем мире это работает. Конечно, хотелось бы побыстрее, чтобы это все вы зажило как-то. И я что? Я обратно. У нас еще работа не закончилась.